Hey guys, Dan here. Uh, we got uh, Zach here from JHS Pedals. How you doing, Zach? Doing great. All right, excellent. We're looking for a guitar player. We couldn't find one. We ended up having There's to settle, never, settle never for never this guy. Where's it, I know, I'm, but I was the I was the best at my price range, so that's why. I'm <laughs> Fantastic. All right, so um, we have obviously last year we released the wonderful JHS Andy Timmons yep. pedal. Yep. Um, which uh, you know, which is spectacular. So, and if you can just uh, give us a little bit of love on your yes. new thing. I mean, it's just it's it's a beautiful, beautiful thing. So. The difference between the Angry Charlie, obviously, and yours, yes, mainly is that three mode switch. Yes, increasing the headroom considerably, and, and just the switchability. So I, I typically leave it in the middle position, which is the 100 watt setting. Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm, I love lots of headroom, uh -huh. so I have as much dynamic range as possible. But if you've seen the Pete Thorne demo, you can see that there's so many more possibilities with the, with the 50 and, and 25 watt mode. Lots of compression and the different types of gain that you can get out of it. So I, I love it. It's just, I mean, obviously I'm a little biased, but. No, it really truly is a very versatile pedal, but I can show up with this pedal at any situation. Normally I have my Lone Stars, but if I'm in a, on a gig, like last year I played, and I had the back line was a Fender Twin. So how am I gonna get my leads down out of a Fender Twin? But I had this modded version, now that the AT pedal in it, it was my tone. So it's pretty, it's, it's, that's, a, that's a nice thing to have that in your back pocket. Yeah, you know? yeah, man. You know? It's so, so fantastic. Yeah. Um, so you're releasing 14 new products yeah. at NAMM, I mean that's amazing. Yeah. One thing that I'm really excited about is your new volume pedal. Yeah. If we could uh, just grab that for a sec. Oh, what's that? So this is really cool man, check this out. So it's a volume pedal with a built-in tuner. Oh, right. nice. Yeah, but you, you can take the module out the back and turn it into an expression pedal as well. Nice. And put an XLR, XLR in as well. I mean, that's yeah, for any acoustic instrument, you can go direct in. Or bass, whatever. You can change the tension on it. You can change the yeah, way that it ramps. Cool, it's really, yeah, really it's nice. Uh, it's uh, active, so um, no tone loss, and it's uh, optical as well, so you'll never break a string. Um, you can adjust the, how the volume swells in and out. Um, you can also have a three or six dB boost if you'd like it. Oh, so, wow. okay. yeah. No, loving that. Yeah. That's really cool. Thanks. Okay, um, is there anything else on here that you want to have? A, oh, the crayon. Yeah. Um, that's, you know, another really fantastic, uh, this is based around the color, the color box. The color yeah. box. Right. So the okay. crayon is basically, it's a slimmed down version just for the guitarist who wants the direct in tones, okay. the fuzz tones, the Beatles style wow. revolution, revolution thing. gets that really compressed, gated sound when you turn it all the way up, yeah. or it can just have that, the feel of uh, plugging directly into a Neve, you know? Pretty good. That's pretty good. I like it, yeah. That's there. Right. right. Awesome. Potential. All right, so Zach, let's have a look at the new things. Uh, this looks very cool. Yeah, so this is a new version of the Charlie Brown. It's got the full Marshall style tone stack with the bass, middle, and treble. We did the same thing to the new version of the Angry Charlie, and so they're updated with a, new, a lot more tonal oh, options. Wow, nice. Um, on these three, the Twin 12 Supervolt Morning Glory, we added this red remote function where you can remotely switch this toggle for a higher gain option. Same that thing. is cool. Yeah, yeah. 
Same thing on the Morning Glory has a high gain option and the Twin 12 has a clean option. So you could uh, make it clean and, and it's just a nice preamp booster. Um, so that's really great. Uh, the Pulp and Peel, we've added an EQ knob and a dirt circuit to it. And it has a direct out so you can run your bass uh, parallel out to the board and to an amp or it's a great acoustic preamp as well. That's fantastic. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, the pollinator's been updated. We have a new gain knob. It's uh, got a lot more headroom and a lot more gain available as well as overdrive tones and fuzz tones. So, wow. Yeah. That's, I mean, they're they are such, um, you know, a lot of guys when they do mods to their pedals to make it up, it's it's something that sort of doesn't really make much difference. But yeah, each yeah. one of these things is just fantastic. Yeah. The remote switch for the boost, I mean, that is so cool. Yeah. We just want to make. Yeah make things as musical as we can. So. Fantastic. Well, guys, uh, you know, loads more to check out from JHS Pedals. But uh, thank you, Andy. Oh, man. Thank you, Fantastic. Thank Thanks, you, Zach. Yeah. And we'll see you guys soon.